how's it going? Welcome to my place. Uh, I'm Swedish and I'm about to demonstrate for you how to sing um, the song that I just released called All That I Need. So I got the piano in front of me. I got the camera right there. And uh, yeah, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing um, to do when you start learning a new song is to listen to it over and over again. So you find the song online, um, hopefully where you can purchase it, um, and uh, you just listen to it. And then once you get a grasp, you start to take little sections, little bite sizes of the song. Um, and also, um, you should have a recording device with you so that you can record what you're doing. That way you can listen back and see and compare to the original and um, see if you need to make any adjustments. And of course, uh, at first it's, it's a good thing to mimic the original and then you can do your own take on it afterwards. When you're mimicking someone else, um, you are taking up or picking up uh, their techniques. So, when you start the song, think about singing softly, think about it being buttery, like you're singing into someone's ear. And the song is about finding um, someone new that's treating you well, from, you know, uh, maybe dating some other people that haven't been that nice to you. The song actually was inspired by, uh, I wrote the song, the lyrics uh, of how I met my husband in a sense. So it's true. So you can take those feelings and put it in to the song. So here we go. When I woke up, eyes dry. When he pulled up, spirit came alive. I've been dancing with strangers, but not tonight. I got enough of crazy. That is the first verse, and so try, try it yourself now, and um, think when he woke up. Your vo your voice is coming in through the back of your throat up into this area, which is the mask. The best sound comes out of this, so thinking about when I woke up I stride when he pulled up spirit came alive I've been dancing with strangers but not tonight I got enough of crazy I've got enough of crazy I was just demonstrating to you the the melody there so you basically break it down listen to it over and over and break down the melody and then when you come to uh, the pre-chorus it's more of a um, higher part of the register so depending on what key that you're singing in you might if you have you know depending on what you what, uh, what kind of singer you are if you're a soprano or alto um, if you're a soprano you might have to um, put the, the song in a different key uh, this one is an E flat so, uh, this is a, a, a very comfortable key for me. But you might have to do it a little higher if you're a soprano. So anyway, so you go. Uh, waiting for forever for us to. So you're going up into a falsetto. Waiting for forever for us to. And nothing seems to measure up to you. I think I can handle something new Are you ready? Slow dance with me Now you come to the chorus And you now you have a little bit more power You you bring in your um, your chest voice Your hands around me Oh, I follow your lead Oh, I'm fading out I'm taking my seat. Notice here in the chorus, this is a, a different rhythm. Do you need to think about? 
I'm fading out weak I'm taking my seat You're all that I need Oh So I'm fading out weak I'm taking my seat You're all that I need Oh You're all that I need You're all that I need You're all that I need you're all that I need. Here we come to the second verse. All right. Falling deeper now. Can't control it. Spiral to the ground. So that is a kind of an interesting um, uh, ad lib there, or a, not ad lib, but an interesting uh, way of doing the melody. Uh, spiral to the ground spiral to the ground so when you're when you're doing this vo vocal you're you're uh, almost um you're pulling it from a uh, almost like a vocal fry situation so it sounds um uh you know how do you say it sounds kind of um you know uh, raspy Fall, fall, falling, falling, falling deeper now. Can't control it. Spiral to the ground, ground. So at the end there, you kind of take take that little um, note to cut off that uh, that um, vibrato. Spiral to the ground, spiral to the ground. Never knew that I knew it. He come around. Didn't think it'd be so crazy, crazy. So there is a um another um ad lib that has uh um the falsetto there at the end. Didn't think it'd be so. Didn't think it'd be so crazy, crazy. Crazy. There it kind of goes from chest voice to falsetto. Did I think it'd be so crazy? Waiting for forever for us to. Nothing seems to measure up to you. And I think I can handle something new. Are you ready? So dance with me. Your hands around me, oh, I follow your lead, oh, I'm fading on weak, I'm taking my seat, you're all that I need, oh, you're all that I need, you're all that I need. And here's a good section to kind of like get the feeling in there, especially if you do an acoustic version. You're all that I need. You're all that I need. And here it comes to the, the bridge part. Are you ready? And that is all all um, falsetto. And at the end when you do, are you ready? You kind of like let go of the of the of the tone, of the note. Are you ready? 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 Slow dance with me. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Slow dance with me. And the, then the chorus comes in again. And you can in this section like now you're really singing it out because you you're like i just want to be with this person man your hands around me oh i follow your lead oh i'm fading on weak i'm taking my seat you're all that i need oh you're all that i need are you ready you're all that i You're all that I need. Are you ready? Are 
you, Betty. Slow dance with me. I want to see you do your own version of, of all that I need. I hope that this was helpful. Just um, think about dynamic. Think about uh, um, where you're placing your vocal. And um, when you're singing it lighter, that, you know, not as much power. It's easier to hit the notes and to do the runs. Um, and then record yourself. I think that's pretty much all that you need. That's pretty much all that you need. So, um... Yeah, you can um, listen to the song, the original song, if you search it on YouTube or if you go to SoundCloud, if you go to my website, SwedishLove.com, Swedish Love with two E's, S-W-E-E-D-I-S-H-L-O-V-E.com. And you can find me on Twitter, Instagram, uh, my website, and um, Facebook, SoundCloud, yeah. And check out Bell Ringer too while you're at it because uh, he's dope. So, anyway, I hope you're having a great day and uh, learn the song and and, uh, and sing it for us and record it. All right, see you next time. Bye.